The final week of the course will address a very important topic relating to coastal environments, adapting to change. Throughout our course, we've explored our local environment from both natural and human perspectives. We've addressed environmental health and resilience, changes over time and space, and scaling from local to global to local. Also, as you probably noticed, the course has progressed to engage you to understand and envision our future. We study and understand our past and present so that we can better address and plan for a sustainable future. Last week, Chris Watson talked about what could happen in Boston with respect to sea level rise. This is a pressing issue, both globally and locally, and we need to know how we can adapt to become more resilient. The materials for this week will look at some existing solutions, approaches, and ideas. I will spend some more time talking about the living labs that I established with my students and the local communities. I will also talk about how we should shift the focus of our urban development towards supporting coastal ecosystems and the services that they provide. The, the final section will address unsustainable fossil fuel consumption and the need for sustainable industrial growth and development via renewables and alternative energies. It is funny we call them alternative, when in nature they are actually the only existing energy source, not an alternative. The lab for this final week will be a very simple one, but something we're hoping will have a large impact. We want you to calculate your personal carbon footprint so you can see where your consumption lies in comparison to your peers. Based on your results, we would like you to develop some ideas, simple and complex, that can be used to minimize your footprint. Think water energy nexus. And finally, the whole crew working on this course wants to thank you for participating, and we truly hope that you've taken away something positive and thought-provoking. Thank you for being with us, and we look forward to hearing your final thoughts about this course.